Hi, so I got this new CC8, which is a brand new condenser microphone from Austrian Audio. I love it, and it does handle a lot of uh, sound pressure, so we decided to use it on the drums, and we already tried a couple of experiments, and I came out with this uh, solution here. So I got enough of the kick drum, enough of the snare, it's pointing at the middle of the snare, but getting also the low end from the kick drum. You're gonna hear, it's very cool. So it's a one mic drum recording. It's also pointing straight to the hi-hat, which is very good. So all in one axis. Same thing with the 818, which we added just for fun for a overhead option. You see the 818 is as a double capsule output. So you can have front and rear as left and right. And we're cutting through the middle of the snare. Otherwise you would have the snare uh, pointing more on one or the other side. So this way it worked for us. So we spare you from all the experiments we did, but this is definitely our favorite position right now. Flo is going to play some beats and um, going to see how it works. So now uh, we just drop the mic a little bit in order to get closer to the kick sound. So it's pointing there, but it will grab more of the low end of the kick and see what happens. Right, so after the drums, we tried on acoustic guitar, and here I thought that CC8 really shined. It has a neutral, very smooth, almost vintage sound. I really like it. It's very linear, very, very warm. You see, I have pointed the microphone off axis, right at the frets, at the last frets of the guitar. It might pick some of the boominess of the hole, but that will get the full wood of the guitar. And then you can eventually correct your sound with a little dip of EQ on the, you know, 180 hertz or whatever, 160 or 200. We also added an 818 in dual mono, like in a stereo, like left and right with the two capsules. It's kind of interesting. I never tried that. We're cutting through, splitting the guitar in two. And um, I will mix this in uh, now and then so you can hear what happens.
We use the Neumann 476 for the recording. So one channel for the CC8 and these two channels, which are identical, just a module color for the A18. Wait. One, two, three. <laughs> I love it. <laughs>